Yo play Gushers yogurt with bursting beads? Exactly. Happy belated, Mike. Well, thanks, Leroy. All right, so Gushers yogurt comes in three flavors. Tropical Punch, which is this one, Blue Raspberry, and Green Apple with bursting beads. I don't really have high expectations for this, judging by the Starburst yogurts we did all the way back during Easter Madness. Locked in Time is going to be about the 90s. If you can make a Gushers yogurt, why not bring back Trix yogurt? Right, I gotta get on with this, haven't I? It has pretty much the same color as one of those Starburst yogurts we did. Looks like I got some bursting beads right there. Bursting beads of what? I'm not sure. I mean, the beads don't taste like anything. I'm not a fan of textures like this. Yeah, you're right. It sucks. We don't have green apple today, so blue raspberry it is. Maybe this will be a little better, because green and blue are obviously the best gushers you can get. But I don't think I've had blue raspberry flavored yogurt. Okay. I'm not getting as many burst and beads here. I mean, I wouldn't buy it again, but compared to the Tropical Punch, the blue raspberry is great. The Tropical Punch, I'm going to give a 5 out of 10. This... 7 out of 10. I get what they're going for, but it's not very gushery. Had it not been for the beads, my scores would probably be a bit higher, because kids wouldn't like textures in their yogurts. Although it's not explicitly marketed for kids, let alone 90s kids. And let me tell you, Locked in Time is going to be bursting with 90s references. I'm not expecting to release it until maybe fall, but it's going to be worth the wait. In the meantime, We'll see you in the next episode.